Walker. I'm Chris Babel. I'm the CEO of Trusty. Um, Trusty is really here to help businesses maximize the value of their data safely, thinking through the privacy implications of that usage of data. Well, as we think through issues in mobile and we work with a bunch of end clients, helping them certify their mobile applications and know that they're kind of collecting data safely, we've also, and are here a lot, to talk about mobile ad networks and how we've worked with them to serve things like the ad choices icon that lets consumers know that they're being targeted. So whether it be a partner like Millennial Media, Pubmatic, Jiwire, um, we work with many, many, many mobile ad networks to help them meet the guidelines either of the EDAA in Europe or the DAA domestically. A good question that you ask about kind of consumer concerns on privacy and one of the things that Trustee has done is run a multi-year survey asking consumers whether they're feeling better, feeling worse. And the three main questions that we ask, the first is, are you concerned about your online privacy? And people basically over 90% of the time said that they have worries about their online privacy. That was up slightly from the past. The second question is, do you trust businesses online? And that was 55%. That was lower than we've seen in the last two years. That's kind of a double-edged sword. For the percentage of, or for the 55% that do have consumer trust in their business, that's great news. They're doing the right things, maybe working with companies as a third party like trustee to kind of validate that they're doing things right by privacy and they're gaining the trust of consumers. The bad news part of that is that 45% of businesses aren't trusted by consumers and are having a hard time getting their apps downloaded, getting interactions online, uh, and things of those nature. The last point is probably the most concerning. We ask consumers, if you don't trust a business online, do you not interact with it, not download an app, um, you know, not use it, etc. And 90%, basically 89% of consumers said, if they don't trust a business, they don't interact with the app. And so what you kind of continually see here is increasing concern, a little bit less business confidence, and that business lack of business confidence causes an increase in not interacting with the business online. So I think these trends are concerning, um, but there are ways to address them through a host of services the trustee provides. I think that it's this big evolution. We've gone from a world where consumers had concerns on privacy, and we've started to address them. We've given them the fact and notice that, hey, this is a targeted ad. We've given them the ability to make their initial choice, which was truly just an opt-out. And that evolution is really to full choice, to full choice to say, I like this category, I don't like this category. Um, and really proliferating it across the ecosystem, meaning it started with an ad on a website, it's moved to an ad in a mobile app or a mobile uh, focused website, but it's making that additional transition to all regions of the world, as well as that transition to being something that is full choice, where you can say, I like a certain category or not, or I like a certain brand or not, versus just being focused exclusively on, I want to opt out of targeted advertising. Yeah, I think um, it's been very interesting for me. Historically, I came from a security company before I came to Trusty, and I've usually spent my time at the RSA Security Conference in San Francisco. For us in San Francisco, it's less than a five-minute walk. Flown halfway across the world and been very, very impressed personally by the show. The quality of the people, the uh, quality of the exhibitors, um, the innovative things that are happening, and honestly, kind of the people coming around asking good, challenging questions, and really, truly looking for people to partner with to find solutions to those problems. So it's really been a great event so far.